So resetting the 768N Firelock NXT dry alarm valve. So this valve only requires 13 PSI to operate. And this particular valve is set to 18 because we got the nitrogen generator set up. And that requires a little bit of higher pressure. So the system goes off, fire, leak, whatever happened, the valve trips. So after we solve that problem, what happened? The main control valve gets closed. Once that's closed, charge line gets closed. Open all the main drains and then hit all the low points out in the uh, system. And then we would close the uh, slow fill and plunge the alarm line. That would clear it back so that the panel can reset. Okay, so now everything's cleared. Now we're going to uh, fill it with air. So this one here is the, uh, the ball valve to control the air line of the compressor. So we open that. And this one has a nitrogen generator so that when we close this one so that we uh, isolate the nitrogen. And <clears throat> then we open the fast fill line on the uh, air pressure maintenance device. And also, because of nitrogen, we would close this valve. And also, this one has an accelerator, so the accelerator line would get closed. And then release the pressure from here and then close it again. Okay, so now we're ready to fill it with air. So at this point, this is open. It's filling with air, the compressor's on. So at 10 PSI, about approximately, you pull up on this. And once it, there'll be a lot of resistance, but once the air pressure is up high enough, it'll just go limp. And at that point, you're ready to fill the, uh, the charge line. So you would open this slowly, and that would fill up this pressure gauge, and then you can tell that it's okay. And that's uh, by pulling on this line. It's the same uh, thing as the principle as the airline. So you just pull on this until this reaches the pressure and then it goes limp again. At that point, <clears throat> you're ready to open the main control valve slowly. And by doing that, you have the drain open a bit as well. And then slowly closing the drain, you'll see the gauge rise up slowly. Once that's up to the pressure, then you can open the valve fully. Then you close the, once it's up to the pressure, you close the fast fill. And then you open the slow fill. And you give it a few seconds and once everything's good, then you can open the accelerator line really slowly. It's really sensitive because that can set off the system really quick. Once that's done, then you can open the nitrogen again. And we close the air compressor line because this one has its own compressor inside that's going to take over. So then we reopen the nitrogen generator line. And that will fill it with air and nitrogen but at that point we uh, we just have it on nitrogen because we're up to pressure here so that's going to replace the air inside this system over several weeks with nitrogen and that's how you reset this valve <clears throat>